Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. A National Historic Landmark, Longwood, 30,000 square feet, is the largest octagonal house in America. In 1859, Haller Nutt, a wealthy Natchez planner, commissioned Samuel Sloan of Philadelphia, a leading 19th century American architect, to design a fashionable home for his suburban estate. Sloan referred to Longwood with its large onion-shaped dome as an oriental villa. Others in Natchez, Mississippi called it Nutt's Folly. Master craftsmen from Philadelphia, along with a team of Nutt slaves, began construction on the mansion in 1860, on the eve of the Civil War. With the outbreak of hostilities in the spring of 1861, the northern workmen dropped their tools and fled. Haller Nutt was able to finish the basement level of the house using enslaved labor. Of the 32 rooms planned for the house, only nine rooms in the basement were ever completed, the upper floors remaining an unfinished shell. Nutt died of pneumonia in 1864. His fortune swept away when his plantations were ruined by both Union and Confederate armies. The widow, Julia Nutt, lived 33 years at Longwood after her husband's death. The Nutt family continued to own and reside in the basement level until 1968 when the house was purchased by the McAdams Foundation of Texas, which in turn donated the property to the Pilgrimage Garden Club. Today, the club operates Longwood as one of Natchez's most popular tourist attractions. I'm Sandy Taylor. I'm chairman of the Longwood Governing Board, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.